Thank you so much. And just with the time that we've got remaining, I want to take a brief moment just to ask our panelists for maybe their key takeaways or their, their final thoughts just before we wrap things up. Now, Akshay, Joe, we heard from you both first. Perhaps you want to uh, outline some of your key takeaways, some of your final thoughts. Over to you. Yeah, thank you. So I'll, I'll speak on behalf of the speaker. Um, I just want to thank everyone for being a part of this webinar. Um, uh, thanking, you know, uh, the knowledge group for hosting this and thanking uh, Kenneth for joining along. With us. Um, I think the big takeaways from this this topic are that we want, you know, those in the audience to know about, you know, what kinds of security measures businesses, whether they are a part of them or they're curious of them, what kinds of security measures businesses need to be aware of and, and be in, empowered by, and what kinds of privacy laws are being introduced, you know, on behalf of clients as ethical ways for companies, you know, to treat their data. Um, so thanks everyone for attendance and uh, I'll hand it over to you, Ken. Yeah, well, I, I would first like to, again, uh, as Joe did, thank everyone for attending. Uh, it's been my pleasure to uh, appear virtually, so to speak, with them and, and, and to be in front of our, 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 our guests. But I, I think uh, my, my, the takeaways I would leave would be one, and what I've already said is one, is to, you know, be completely familiar with your system, uh, know what it is you're doing with it and who has access to and all that. But then the flip side, and I, I, I focused away from the, the, the compliance component, I focused on more of the functional aspects of it. But the, the flip side is you, you need to make sure you understand what your legal obligations are because knowing what data you have and what you're doing with it, you need to make sure that you understand what laws and regulations apply to that usage and what you need to do to make sure that you are in compliance at all times. And, and, and part of that is, is a function of understanding what the penalties are for violation, because obviously, you know, in certain, you know, it, it, with respect to California CCPA, the statutory damages components provide a, a rather onerous uh, set of penalties, which, you know, are meant to incentivize compliance, you know, from that end. But, but that, that's the other piece is not only know what your system does functionally, but also know what your legal obligations are and what you need to do to, to, to implement compliance.